This is uh, Chrome OS booting from a live CD. Um, this is the first time I'm seeing it. Um, I hope it's booting from a live CD. I hope it ain't trying to install or nothing like that. I don't even know what the hell it looks like. I'm just showing everybody. Um, um, I basically just this is what you would get. If you were to go download uh, download the ISO, there's a couple of them out there. I downloaded the biggest one. It's like 600 something megabytes. I uh, put the ISO on a CD. I tried to do it on a USB drive. It wouldn't work, so I could show my friends, but it wouldn't work. But I just did it live from this from my CD. Um, I'm using Ubuntu 10.10, .10. so. I don't know what the hell it's doing. The computer's making a bunch of noise. Yeah, it's a shitty computer. I've had it for a while now, but um, I just want to share with everybody my experience. Google Chrome, pretty excited. I don't know what the studio thing is. I don't know what the hell it is. Like I said it's making a lot of noise. Okay, we got a little progress bar. <coughs> Uh, hopefully I can upload this to YouTube. Hopefully it doesn't take over 10 minutes. I don't know what the hell it's doing. Hopefully it's not installed. I'm going to assume it's not installed. Being that I booted from my CD. Because I do not want to overwrite my uh, Ubuntu 10.10. .10. But if that sounds stupid and somebody's out there like, Oh, duh, idiot, you're doing it from the CD. You know, I'm not really... You know, I'm more of like a tester guy, like a beta tester. I try out a lot of stuff. Um, right now, I'm filming this with my HTC HD2 with Android 2.2 Froyo on it. The dark side build, I think I got. So I'm more of just like a tester. I like to see things, and uh, I figured I'd get it and check it out. I want to know if somebody thinks... It's possible to put Chrome OS on the HD2. I talked to my brother-in-law, and uh, he said he'd have to look at it. He said he hasn't looked too much into it. I mean, I heard it's I heard it's lighter than Ubuntu, and we've all seen Ubuntu on an HTC HD2. So, with Chrome OS being so light, uh, I think it might be a possibility a good a good ROM. So, I don't know. I know the Windows 7 phone is out or about to be out. A couple people have some videos up. I hope this thing isn't trying to install. <laughs> oh, no. This is it. This is it, guys. Um, oh, okay, that's a live install. Live install. No, I don't want to install it. Um, choose your search engine. Let's go, go. I can't believe they have Bing. Why would they have Bing? They must be, Microsoft must be like, if you can't beat them, join them, huh? Wow, this almost looks like Ubuntu. Chrome default browser, start Google Chrome. Wow, everything looks like Ubuntu. I heard that you can get an Ubuntu theme for it. For your, I mean, no, I'm sorry. I heard that you can get a Google Chrome theme for your Ubuntu. But this is it. Um, I mean, this would be pretty sick if this was on a... Uh, let's try. Pretty, pretty sick if somebody got this on an... Um, wow, it's fast. What are my options? God, that is fast. Let's see what's on computer. Um, this would be pretty sick if somebody put this on... Put this on a... Um, on the HD2. I mean, I think it would run perfect. Wow, it comes with open office. Let's see how fast that opens. I'm definitely going to show this to my brother-in-law. It's taking some time to open. I'm assuming that's because um, it's booting from a CD. Everything is going from a CD. you got documents, places, desktop, file system. Yeah, you can definitely tell that this was a... 
this was built off a of Linux kernel. I don't know how good my quality of my video is. I'm trying my hardest. Uh, I'm not going to take up too much more of your time. I just want to show basically um, Google Chrome. You can get it. I forgot. I'll try to post the website and uh, information or whatever it's called, the little editor thing. I'll try to post a link to where I downloaded it if you don't already have it. Um, leave me any questions or anything like that because I need help also. Um, if anybody out there, especially the um, the XDA developer group, if they want to start trying to put uh, this version out there so people can get it and uh, put it on their HD2 phones, that'd be sick. I mean... I'm sure there's got to be a downloader. Somebody can write a download so that you can use your 3G service or your Wi-Fi. Because I heard that Android is gonna is gonna be obsolete after a while, and they're gonna have Google Chrome OS and then Chrome OS Mobile, and they're gonna drop the Android. That's just what I heard. I don't know if that's correct, but um, that's just I mean, that's Open Office. I got about two more minutes left. So, well, four, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna cut it short. Uh, I don't know what the hell this is. Install, remove software. I'm assuming they have like a store almost. My thing was, why wouldn't if you have so many people? Oh, I don't even know if that's a password. Let's see, root. Please enter root. Oh, okay. Duh. My question is, somebody should create an operating system that has options for apps. Like, if I should be able to get 3,000 plus apps with my Android operating system, why shouldn't I with my Chrome operating system? I mean, if I wanted to go get um, a Yahoo ticker, Yahoo um, finance ticker, I should just be able to go to the app store, click market somewhere, and, and download it. I mean, I think that would be a pretty good feature. Nobody else really has that right now. I mean, if you think about it, you have to go to the website and download it. You have to go to the website and download it. Um, Ubuntu is pretty good with it. I'm not going to lie. Ubuntu has it. They have their little market. You just type it in. It's right there. But I think if um, Google were to do that, if they were to add that, it would, it would make Android users, like, really, really excited to use Google Chrome because... You would just click market and download whatever the hell you wanted. ESPN radio, anything. You wouldn't have to go to ESPN.com, then click radio, then listen to the radio. And those are just some ideas. I don't know. Like I said, I'm coming up on eight minutes now on my video, so I'm going to cut it short. Um, I don't know what the hell it's doing, but hit me back. Please leave comments. Like I said, I'm new to this. Um, but, you know, everybody's input can... Uh, push this Chrome OS thing over the edge because we really need to get rid of um, Windows. <laughs> All you guys who don't like Windows. Alright guys, have a good day.